this record was created over a two year span where um, I was coming out of a relationship. There was a lot of different things changing in my life when I set out on this kind of like, we'll call it journey. And um, it started with this crazy road trip that I took for three months across America. Um, and it, you know, it started in, I drove to Nashville, spent two weeks there writing and I just took my dog with me. It was just me and my dog. And then I drove from Nashville to LA, which took like a week of straight driving. <laughs> and, um, and I spent two weeks in LA and then after that kind of went through with uh, one of my good friends and we just would wake up every morning and say, where do you want to go? Like it was our first taste of freedom in a long time. And then that just kind of snowballed into, you know, discover rediscovering myself again. And um, a lot that went into that um, spiritually and mentally and, and all of these different aspects. So for me, that's what that, there, there's so many themes in each little song about that. Mm -hmm. um, so it's a, it's an overall, you know, arc. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. Gotcha. Um, so can you tell us a little bit about your writing process for the record? It sounds like part of it was during this big road trip you took. Um, yes and no. Um, I would say the right, well, so the writing process for me looks differently each time I write. Um, I think it's really exciting to get in the room with, with somebody and write, you know, have co-write situations. I find that, um, you know, when I'm writing, I'm very sporadic and I end up, you know, maybe it's ADD, but I like start three different songs. You know, when I'm writing, I usually like it, it's like it all comes out at once and I'll like, but I'll write, you know, the, the first verse and like chorus and then I'll like stop and then I'll like, you know, go to another one and write that and then and then come back and finish them. It's a weird way. Not always, but that's like, um, that's pretty common. Sometimes I get through a whole song myself in one in one sitting, but usually I have to like write a few different ones and then come back to them. Um, but yeah, it, it started out with um, trying to find a producer for the record. So I was writing with, um, you know, a bunch of different people and just getting a feel for, for what I wanted and, and trying new things and new sounds and stuff, which was really exciting. Um, and then when I got to LA, I did that as well with a bunch of different writers. And it was just like, exploration at that point to see what I wanted the record to be and to see what songs were like, you know, clinging to me. Um, and then after that, I think it was just me writing. Um, I had moved to Nashville. And so that was a whole different world. And I was meeting a lot of writers down there and having a lot of fun meeting people and writing with them. So it was very collaborative and, you know, um, really beautiful in that way. And then some of the songs were just songs that I wrote you know, in my living room, as I usually do. Um, and then I met my producer out in LA on a different writing trip. And um, that's when that like really clicked. And so some of the some of the songs on that record are also from that more recent one. So we have songs from like, a year ago, two years ago, right up until like, you know, a couple months before we said, Okay, this is the record and those songs made it kind of thing. So it was very very different uh, method than I had ever done before, but super exciting because it was so new. And I feel like a lot of that came out on the record as well, that exploration and just trying new sounds and different things and having the time also to kind of sit on it and mess around with things and add little bits here and there. There wasn't a rush, you know what I mean? Just to yeah. get things right. 